break out the Sperry's and unmoor the sailboat, because the Jeep Grand Wagoneer is back for 2022. In its wake follows a wave of returning Jeep customers that falls into the subtle but not too subtle subculture of stealth wealth. In fact, it's been quite a while since an American automaker had something that attracted this rarefied and ethereal type of buyer. You know, the type of people usually found parked on manicured gravel drives in the greater New England area and in select preppy hamlets spread out over the rest of the U.S. Think less Rolls Royce and forget about lime green Lambos, we're talking about you get it or you don't money sleds like the Mercedes-Benz E-Class wagon or most modern Volvos. Some folks rumble around Cape Cod in star-spangled stuff like the Chevrolet or GMC Tahoe slash Suburban slash Yukon and a selection of well-optioned pickups. But most of these connected Ivy legacies stick to tall, dark, and handsome stuff from Germany, Sweden, and England. It didn't used to be like this. America's old money once parked the first-gen Wagoneer and later Jeep Grand Wagoneers next to Connecticut Colonials in enough numbers to storm the beaches of Southampton. Well, they still do, you'd keep auction sites brimmed for years if you scalped every vintage Range Rover and Wagoneer still chug-a-chugging through rural New England's tight lanes. Yes, Jeep love runs deep there. New Yorkers, especially those extant within NYC city limits, love the war-born brand, particularly the Grand Cherokee. And so does everyone, as the Grand Cherokee was Jeep's best-selling model in 2020. Having already long gone down a few sizes to sweep up the sales with the Cherokee, Compass, and Renegade, the brand has nowhere to go but up. First it did so with the elongated three-row Grand Cherokee L in 2021, and now with the Behemoth Wagoneer and Grand Wagoneer for 2022. We can already hear the Stellantis, formerly FCA, cash machine firing at full capacity in Michigan even from all the way out here on the California coast. Truck UV don't get too hung up on the names, both the 2022 Jeep Wagoneer and 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer are the same fundamental truck, just outfitted with different levels of exterior bling, interior niceties, and tech accoutrement. Dimensionally, both SUVs slide right between the Chevrolet Tahoe slash Ford Expedition and the larger Chevy Suburban, meaning both Wagoneers have the physical presence of a Nimitz-class Godzilla carrier. Oops. Sorry about that truck slip up above. However, since the body on frame Wagoneer twins ride on the robust DT platform plucked from under the Ram 1500 pickup family, calling it a truck isn't entirely off base. The Wagoneer also has a best in class towing capacity, a whopping 10,000 pounds regardless of powertrain, but we'll get to the engines in a bit. For now, just look at these things. Both the new Grand Cherokee and its swollen Grand Cherokee L Big Sib offer some of the sharpest style in the midsize segment, and the 2022 Jeep Wagoneers are faithful extrapolations of this smooth edge butch vibe. Although the Wagoneers physical size might not shock you on roads teeming with HD trucks and GM's suite of full-size SUVs, these Jeeps tower over you with aggressive, upright proportions and puffy fender flares at all four corners. It's no wonder Jeep representatives refer to the new pair as little buildings with a stately architectural design. If it's a building, it sure isn't a government warehouse. The Escalade baiting 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer is requisitely glitzy and chrome-drenched, though not obnoxiously so. Remember, the new Wagoneer has a shot at the stealth wealth types who may have grown up in the backseat of the first-generation SUVs, so it can't be quite as purposefully gaudy as the caddy. We can tell by your fine clothes and bulging wallet that you're a grand type of person. So take pride in the fact your Grand Wagoneer sneers at lesser Grand Less Wagoneers with a black painted roof, fancier grill design, chrome window surrounds, and premium exterior LED lighting. Our favorite bit? The two-piece aluminum model lettering with copper chino accents on the Top Dog Series 3 trim. Copper trim is underutilized in the automotive space, so it's nice to see it make an appearance here on such an important vehicle. The 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer is nice on the outside but its maxed-out interior space should drop your jaw to the dirt like a cartoon. This is the most upscale interior we've seen from a Chrysler brand, yeah, yeah, Stellantis, in decades, accounting for the standards held by previous eras. Significant attention went into the interior differentiation between the standard Wagoneer and the Grand Wagoneer, and it shows. There's too much to generalize, so we'll start with the upholstery. Seeing as the base Wagoneer wears Napa leather surfaces, Jeep stepped up with the enigmatic Palermo grade leather that's both quilted on the seats and extended to the door panels and dash surrounds. But the wood trim is our favorite. On the Grand Wagoneer, all wooden panels are real walnut, and it's some of the nicest we've interacted with outside of heavy hitters like Mercedes-Benz and Bentley. 
There's even a wooden surround panel for the ignition button, itself a smart detail with its angle design and integrated stitched leather trim. Elsewhere, real metal frames portions of the dash to offset the dark wood, and the large rotary shift knob in the center of the console sports a complex knurled pattern cut into the outer bezel. It's a warm, rich environment that catapults the Jeep name deep up market and offers significantly more character than the equivalent Escalade or Navigator.